my pronunciation of Italian words stems from Inglorious Bastards. So, buongiorno, welcome to Shaving with Greg Tardiff. If this is your first time watching the channel, thanks. Beautiful day, I think. I'm in the basement bar area. Maybe make a boozy drink later. But what holds today is the Fatip razors that I have in my hand. I have two of them, okay? I have a slant and I have a uh, classic safety razor. Uh, the classic safety razor, it is the Rasoyo Grandi Gold Classic. Fat tip. Fancy boxes, by the way. I like these boxes because you can tell, and I'm sure this is nice at the stores if you can buy these in person somewhere, you can tell that this is gold and it's not slanted because that's straight. And then for the slanted, you can tell that this is chrome and slanted. And then on the side here, you can see it says open comb. Perfect box, perfect box. Good shapes, good shapes, open combs. I went with the open combs uh, because ever since I had the double open comb from Phoenix, uh, I've been intrigued by the way that it moves the lather off your face or like re-lathers and does some fancy stuff and it feels comfortable and I like it. I like the way it feels and I like the way that it kind of makes like a little lather beard as you're shaving. That's kind of fun to watch, fun to watch. Um, these are not the biggest handles, they're the perfect size for me. Weight wise, they're about 66 to 67 grams. I, mean, I like a shorter handle, even though I got big chunky hands. I don't know, it just feels more comfortable. I feel like I have more control over the shave than I do with long handle. That being said, they're 67, 66 grams. Uh, and then I have a few other ones that are in the same price range about $40 uh, that I want to compare it to so that if you have one of these, most people have at least one of these. Uh, and if you don't, pick up one of these. Edwin Jagger, DE86, DE89, DE87 and eight maybe. Uh, it's about the same weight as the as both of these and the, both of them are about the same length. So you can see though the Edwin Jagger is significantly longer than the fat tips and that one's about the same price. The 96R, however, is about 10 grams, 12 grams heavier, and you can see uh, still quite a bit longer. But the balance on the weight, I think, goes to the fat tips because it just feels like a really balanced razor when you're shaving. It doesn't feel top heavy or bottom heavy. It feels good. Which brings me to like the 34C, which is a little bit more expensive than the fat tips. You know, that one being about $48, and this being a two piece versus the three piece of the fat tips. But you can see they're about the same same length, do a head to head comparison so you can see the head shapes. Um, but I find that the, the, the curvature of the blade on these provides a more aggressive shave than on the Merker or the Edwin Jagger. A little bit closer to the Parker 96R. I get good shaves with the 96R, I get better shaves with the fat tips. And I've been typically just doing two pass shaves at this point during the winter season because I'm a sensitive little boy. Anywho, the Marvel from fine is the heavy weight of this. This is 93 grams, so it's 30, 27 grams heavier than both of these. Uh, but it's uh, lengthwise about the same, about the same. The shave style on this is a lot different because it has that big bar at the bottom, boxed in top, uh, kind of like a, a Henson, I guess you could say. The Gillette Heritage, uh, is about $35. It says it's 79 grams, but it feels lighter than both of these fat tips. And the fat tips again are 66 and 67 grams. The weight on the Heritage is definitely in the head. Whereas again, these are super balanced and feels like it's, you know, one weight on each inch. The fat tips are hollow handled, which is kind of cool, probably for weight, but also you see through it? Yeah, you can see through it. So 
You have a little telescope here too, which is really nice. So thanks for putting that telescope in there, uh, fat tips. Yeah, ultimately, if you're in the market for low cost razor with some panaz to it, because these uh, razors are very classy looking, shiny and beautiful. I recommend it, provide a really good shave. They do have a, a straight bar versions of each of these and various different lengths of handles too. So check them out. I saw them, never heard of them before bought them ordered them and then like the day they came out i started seeing pictures and stuff of people using them it was like all right that's just how the universe works or the, the matrix works i guess you know you buy buy a beetle see a beetle type of thing i recommend these razors for comfortable quasi aggressive shave uh easy to control and for a slant i really like it i think it's great appreciate you watching if you feel the urge to subscribe to this channel just do it i'd appreciate it uh and so would your friends They'd be like, wow, this guy's really cool. He likes Greg Tardiff. Thanks for liking me. Thanks for watching. Have a happy new year. Okay, goodbye. Yeah, goodbye.